strange feeling deep inside? That's the feeling of satisfaction after you did something good. Congratulations. Goodbye. Hey, it ain't our problem, Playboy. It's yours. That said, I know what I'm going to do. That right. You cold, Nico. Peace and love. Where are you going, man? I want to go to uh, Zeno Time Street. Sorry about the smell. I just laid some gas in here. This is Dwayne. Get here we are. It's a wrap. Yo, Whitey's back. Yo, what you doing? You got rid of Dwayne already? I thought the old dog would have put up more of a fight. <laughs> I didn't kill Dwayne. Well, what you doing back here then? Step to it, motherfucker. Well, I was thinking that maybe Dwayne is not the problem. Maybe it's you. Motherfucker! You think you can touch this shit? You think I got here by letting little bitches like you fuck with me? I own you! Nobody owns me! It's on and popping now! You done, son! You in a tall back, family! Come on, come on! You want to die? Come on! I showed you the world, gangster! You don't control this shit! Where are you going, playboy? Another motherfucker gone and let the money go to his head. Not such a big man now, are you? Get this motherfucker! to kill Dwayne, playboy. I thought you was money. You a low-rate bitch. People respected me. I made a difference. You didn't change the game. The game changed you.
Dwayne, I dealt with Playboy. You should know that he asked me to end you first. He was going to pay me a lot of money to do it. Shit, man. He was a good kid back in the day. Always hungry, though. Always wanted more. Maybe I should have seen it then. Kept a closer eye on him. You can't predict what people will become. You're right. I can't give you no money for helping me, son. But I got the deed to Playboy's fancy silk sheet loft. You can have it. Hey, man, I seen where you're living. You should take it. Nah. It'll make me remember the kid too much. Maybe he'll stop by my place sometime, though. Hang out with me. I don't have many friends left, you know. I'll give you a call sometime soon, Dwayne. Later on. All right. for Elizabeth Torres together? You mean I saved your ass? Well, if I'd have known it was such a big deal to you, I would have asked you to let them kill me. Anyway, if you're in need of extra funds, I'm in need of a good man. Come over to me. Oh, shit, that's crazy, man. Pull over! Hey, where you going, man? So can you yeah, take me up. to Amity? Sorry, man, this is... Uh, it's Nico Bellic. I'm here for an interview. Come in, I'll buzz you through. Welcome to Goldberg, Ligner, and Scheister, sir. Mr. Bellic, welcome. I'll just see if Mr. Goldberg is available. Mr. Goldberg, Mr. Bellick has arrived for his interview. Okay, great. Uh, tell him to come through to my office. Would you please follow me, Mr. Bellick? Sure. Mr. Goldberg is such a saint. He teaches kids to swim, you know. He's just so warm and giving. All he cares about is making the world a better place. And boy, are you in trouble if you get in his way. Do you think he'll like me? He's just in here. Don't be nervous. He doesn't bite. Hello, Nico. What's that short for, Nikolai? I'm looking for a man who can get jobs done right. Nikolai, I like your resume. You seem to be the sort of man who would go the extra distance. I just need to take another look. Get myself reacquainted with your experience. So, you're the sort of man who doesn't wait to get told what to do. A guy who looks at the world, sees problems, and tries to fix them? Sure. My problem is that people don't notice the decay in society. They leave the decay alone, and soon it's too late, so you have to pull the whole tooth. Yeah? I am the guy who goes around shaking people. For people, read society, read city hall. I shake them, and I say floss. Get rid of the rotting flesh stuck in your teeth. Prevent decay. Mouthwash, you hear me? There's this cop. Good cop, but he thinks he's above the law. He's not. You wanna know why? Because the law is clear. I'm gonna crush him into dust. No one is above my judgment. You understand me? Okay. Here at GLNS, we're pushing things to the limit. We're on the front line, young man. A man I was recently with in this office, in this very room, was murdered. You gotta fight for what is just in this world. You do. 
Anyway, give me an example of some time where you've worked as part of a team. I work alone. You gotta say something. You can't just do nothing and waste both our time. Sure, stand up if you want to. Whatever makes you comfortable. You're just a... Where are the... <laughs> I guess I didn't get the job. I need your car. Here are the files. Great. Peace at last. I feel cleansed. You silenced Goldberg, too, right? I don't need to worry about him? 
is done. Whoa, music to my ears. A weight has been lifted. Here's your payment. Sure, Ma, sure. <laughs> yeah, I've always been a good boy. You know me, Ma. Y yes, I'll make commissioner. No, I don't care about Packy. Listen, Ma, I I've got to go. Uh, love you, too. Good to see you. I'm sure. Uh, you know, it's funny, but I see a lot of me in you. You know why? No. You know there's no good. And no evil. Just shades of fucking gray. Whatever. You make things 1% better, that's enough. That's our duty. If you say so. Oh, I do say so. I want to make things a bit better. By any means necessary. And you? What do you want? I want to get paid. Sure. Yeah, sure you do. So listen. I got something I need you to do. This is the last time. Of course. Some drug dealer is holed up in a tower block in East Holland. Now, this scumbag's been pushing drugs, pimping women, you name it, he's done it. I need him dealt with. Isn't that police work? <laughs> sure. <laughs> and the moon is made of cheese and the streets is paved with gold. Wake up! Excuse me? The guy's guilty as sin! He is sin! <laughs> but it'll take me a year to get the evidence. More, maybe. And maybe good men will get taken down by that <laughs> evidence. <laughs> maybe people make mistakes. But this guy is scum. How much? Oh, how much? Good money. Um, two G's. Two? You mean five. <laughs> you know, if someone was to tell me you were some fresh off the boat killer with more balls and brains, I'd say he was about right. Uh, okay, you got a deal. Head on up to Vaux site and call me. Five G's. I'm outside the project. Where is he? Should be on the second floor. Keeps an eye on all his boys from up there. The guys you see are gonna be working for that scumbag in one way or another. Anyway, these projects all got the same layout. A staircase leading up on either side. Try to get off the ground floor before getting violent. Violent? Me? Yeah, you. 
Remember, you're doing a real service for the community by getting rid of this scumbag. Francis McCreary is the community now? You're starting to sound like your friend Manny. Damn, son, you don't belong around here. Eat me. You in the wrong hood, oh, yeah. homie. You ready to die? Now. Can't hide. Now. Take me to your Here we are. It's a wrap.
Yeah. You better find cover. Hi there. How you doing? It's going to get nasty around here. Don't give me a reason. to turn ugly? Man, you got me chill. I surrender. You wouldn't kill an unarmed man, would you? This isn't my choice. The police want you dead. Yo, it's that rat cop McCreary, ain't it? You don't like a younger brother with ambition. Tell you what, I'll reform. I get out the game, get a, a GED or some shit. Make something of my life. McCreary gonna think I'm dead. Word. Come on, boss. Don't kill me, boss. I'm too young to die. Please. Sorry. I tried to convince me to let him go. Said he'd get out of town. I finished him anyway. Good move. You shouldn't trust a word that comes out of that scum's mouth. The streets are a little bit cleaner now he's gone. One percent is all we can hope for. Whatever you say. They don't look much cleaner from where I'm standing. <laughs> 